Uh, stress is in and out. Well, hello, everybody. Uh, before I start the episode, let me just uh, get a little prefacer as to what the fuck has just happened. I, I uh, recorded an entire fucking episode, like a 23-minute episode of Minecraft for everyone. And uh, it, it uh, basically just shit the bed and uh, got a game capture, which you can see right here, which I am in. And, oh, God. The videoception. Just look at it. It's going to keep going inside. The, oh, my God. Let's stop that. Okay. So, basically, I lost all the footage. Uh, I was a super salty Sam about it. And I'm just going to shoot. I'm going to fucking do another episode for you guys. And uh, because if I try, I can't even, like, save the footage. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Um I tried uh, bringing the footage out and seeing if I could actually sa uh, save it. And, oh, God, no. And, uh, you know, I just, uh, it, I, I tried, and this is, this is what happens when you get um, uh, re recording, oh, whoops, uh, recording stupid shit on a multiple video outputs. Where the hell am I here? Video. Uh, outputs. On a graphics card. Uh, so you put that in, right? And la di da di da You get... Shit like this. Yeah. Fucking... So... And... Basically, so I'm just gonna start over. Give you guys another awesome episode to... To deal with. So... Uh, you can see I tried editing in here, and it just wasn't fucking having any of it, and so, uh, I did not want, want to, damn it, all the hell, are they the same size now? I mean, we're, we're square, okay, cool. Okay, right, left, right, left, go in, and let's begin, shall we? Welcome, everybody, to an awesome new series. Oh, God, I already screwed it up. I have it in the fucking... God, whatever. Close it. Uh, <laughs> welcome to an awesome new series where uh, today I'm going to be doing some Minecraft for you. And uh, I really I really wanted to play Minecraft on the channel for a while now. And um, trying to make it line up with everybody's schedules and uh, having multiplayer where other people can play the the game at the same time and, like using uh quality audio that i want to have and it's it's just a nightmare let's make sure this is still recording so i'm not having a meltdown all of a sudden and okay good we're still good cool uh details no what am i doing here other full screen if you uh if i can actually resurrect the old episode i will upload it but you saw what happened in premiere and that's probably not gonna happen so as you can see, I am not running 1.9, and uh, you guys can all kill me now if you want, but I can't get my mods to work, and that was the big surprise, and everything it was awesome. And was, uh, <laughs> uh, I like 1.9, but when you see my mods, you'll understand. So create new world, and uh, rich. Oh, damn it, every time, even in the other episodes, son of a bitch. Retro Millennia, swig. Swerve. Oh, uh, you know what, fucking no. Swer swerve because uh that's that's how we go and hopefully this is a good one the last one was a fantastic map and i got i'm just so upset that i i have to I, I can't like just lose everything yeah that looks nice okay so i'm recording in 1080p 60 frames a second for all of you lovely millennials out there and you can see that i am running a fantastic graphics mod a sh they're called shaders for anybody that doesn't know how to or not know how to, but doesn't know, like, or isn't familiar with that sort of thing. These are shaders. And it basically makes your game all pretty. Why is there just... What the... Oh, I'm taking all your food. Thanks. If only I had a collar. I would, uh... I would train you guys. Wow, look at all this fucking... Okay, I can say... I can handle it. I can dig it. Free food from all you guys. Why are you guys looking at me like that? Oh, probably because I... Yeah, because I have meat. Okay. So, can I domesticate them like that? No way. Oh, my God. No, come back here. Come, come back here. You guys are gonna protect me. Come on, come back up here. Come, come make pups. Okay. I don't know if they can actually do that. I don't. I don't remember if the, those guys. Whoopsie. If those guys can breed. Pick it up. So in 
and before I was, uh, I, I'm still kind of unacquainted with all of this just because uh, <laughs> it's, it's been a little while. Just gonna mine this tree out really quick, and uh, just getting used to all the controls again and everything was after like. Um, I'm gonna pretend that I didn't talk about anything and just make it feel like it's all fresh again. So basically, um, I'm, I've been playing a lot of Factorio, and I've talked about it in the other ones, but here I feel like because it's just me, I can actually go in in, in depth with everybody here. And uh, Factorio, so basically you've crash landed on a planet, right? And you have to, uh, you basically, that looks really cool. You have to uh, launch a rocket back into space and basically get your bootay off the, uh, Oh, what am I doing? Off, off the planet. And, uh, thank you. And, um, the, you can play it in two ways, kind of like how I'm playing on Minecraft right now. You can play it with, uh, we can, wow, that looks fucking gorgeous. Just let that take, and that water looks so realistic. That's insane. I think one thing I love about this, uh, Seuss mod is that, uh, this is Seuss Ultra for anybody wondering. Um, is it just, makes the game come to life so much more. Oh, I can show you guy, that guy that uh, really quick. Show you guys that. So this is this is uh, with the Seuss mod, obviously. You need a very beefy graphics card to run it at 60 frames a second. And so if you're modding, uh, you go to video settings and you go to shaders, and it's Seuss Ultra. I just downloaded, downloaded like a huge pack of just mods to go off and see what they all look like, and they're fun. If you turn it off, you can watch this blank right there. Boom, reloads, and boring. Look at that. It's so bland. And I mean, don't get me wrong. Some people really like vanilla Minecraft. And it is nice to change it up every once in a while. But now that I have a tower that can actually run this, like, at above 60 frames a second, it's it's just fantastic. And uh, I've become very spoiled with what it looks like. And um, the Seuss... Oh, whoopsie. The Seuss motion blur one is fun. But, like, it emulates, like, your character blinking. So the screen, like, flickers black and white. Or not black and white, but just flickers black, and I don't really care for that because of the. Uh, I think it just like it kind of feels unnatural. But the motion blur itself looks really cool, and anyone wants to know, I'm getting about there. You go, see, 100 and, about 120 frames averaging, which is nice. I don't even know what chunks I'm at right now. You can see all my specs and such if you want. Here you go, Skase for a uh, for a fellow Minecrafter, good sir. And uh, if anybody hasn't checked out Pixels and Pino, go check them out. Just like uh, Cocktails and Console. Because Melissa's awesome. And, uh, hey, girl, we're going to be doing some uh, Long Island iced tea soon. Don't you worry. I'm going to be doing the non-alcoholic version because you, <laughs> you know me. And looking, locking all that shit away. What am I doing? Um, oh, that's one way to do it. Um, I need to make I need to make some, some materials here. Get get in the... Go in there. Give me, the, give me those. Give me some sticks here. Uh, give me half. I'll take one, two, three. Take 12 sticks, and I'll take those back now. And we go there, and give me... Uh, I don't need a wooden axe, because I'm just going to go right to stone. So I guess just give me a shovel. Cool. And uh, I hope that I can just find stone here. All right, cool. I didn't want to dig into any, any stand. Oh, what am I doing? i got to get a pickaxe. Derpy doodle. Um... So, Factorio, right? We're, we're playing Factorio now, and it has just completely consumed my entire gaming life, essentially. Whoopsie. And uh, it, it's, it's really bad, actually, how much I've been playing it. I think I, I, I logged so many hours. In, like in the, I hear spiders already. This is not making me happy. Um, why am I already hearing spiders? Am I really that close? Like, did I just pop in on a cave already? Um, but, so you've crash landed on this planet, you're trying to launch rockets into space, and you start off as a really crappy engineer, essentially, um, you have the ability to research new, uh, technology, more or less, I think that's what it's called, is under the hotkey is T for technologies, and, um, you, all they start you off with is a burner mining drill, and uh, a furnace. And essentially the burner mining drill runs on coal and what it does is it digs up raw materials, kind of like what I'm doing right now, but it's a top-down view and you you have to have your character kind of run around on the screen. And um, I might actually play it on here at some point just so I can kind of show you guys, like me and my cousin Tim, or my cousin Tim and I, I don't know how you fucking say what the fuck, I don't care. Um, you, uh, you have to run around and basically um, we 
have built a very, very efficient factory. I mean, it's still very polluted, but it, uh, basically you can play with or without bugs. Uh, that's what attacks you. They're called aliens because they, and they give you alien artifacts when you kill them. And, uh, I'm just waiting for this damn thing to blow up. And then I'm going to go get me some upgraded weaponry. Cavalry, bring in the cavalry here. And, uh, oh, I should probably be having a timer for this just so I can, uh, actually keep it kind of, kind of straightforward because I, I, I had planned on making these about 20 minute episodes but um you're so you're digging stuff up and there we go I'm I'm very so addicted to like just sandbox games in general and I, I guess you can kind of consider that but it's also kind of like a tower defense game which is also one of my favorite style of games I don't need sand yet but uh and, and uh I just I love the concept of it because you're you're trying to survive kind of like this. And speaking of surviving, I didn't see a, a single animal that could give me some health here. Got to make a some oh shouldn't have done that something for them. Um, oh dear, what the hell is that? No, it's not. Oh god! Oh my god! That spider looks terrifying. Get the hell away from me! Nope! 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 A whole lot of nope right there. Okay. <laughs> um, oh, Jesus. Thank you. Uh, yeah, uh, I've, I've been thinking about playing uh, some ser- some scary games on here. And uh, I want to know what you guys would like to would think about that. I think that would be pretty funny. Because I, in the last episode, a bat flew by me. And I freaked the hell out. Because I thought I, w- I had, like, a spider on top of me or something. That spider's face is terrifying, though. Can we all just agree for a second that this mod likes that spider look fucking horrifying i would cry if i saw that in my dreams what do you i don't know what the how fucking bitch want to fight me about that yeah come here come over to me big boy let's go you and me one-on-one 1v1 360 no scops you know what i'm saying okay and uh oh no we're not gonna go mess with him yet i'm gonna be i'm gonna play it safe and i'm gonna leave because i have found a cave unintentionally and uh i like i like the outside safe world right now so sorry not sorry going to uh seal your fate really quick there guy if there was only a way that i could actually remember well actually what are my coordinates right now um 257 one negative 166 all right i should probably write that down actually i'm gonna put that in my phone right now so and um one thing I really like about Factorio is that it just it it's it's got infinite replay value, kind of like this game where you can where where do where I keep hearing them, but I don't I must have just sealed them off. Um, what the hell? I know those wolves are not growling at me right now, little bastards. Um, let's see what we can see here. I got can't see a damn thing. Uh, yeah, like that's gonna work. <laughs> and um, all right, there we go. Not a damn thing. Just trees for days. All right, so <gasps> damn it. Oh uh, dear. So um, I guess I'm, I guess I'm just gonna stop talking about factory because you guys get the basic idea. You gotta you gotta build new technology. You gotta advance your way up high enough to basically launch a rocket and get the hell off the planet and it's just you and uh, or you could play with friends kind of like wish, what i wish i was just doing right now but that's obviously not going to happen and uh really shouldn't keep running so i can actually keep some some meat on me i mean i have four raw mutton right i have sheep on me right now but other than that and uh so I, you know, I, one thing that's really gonna be fun about this this series is that uh, I'm going for the end game here. I'm going to take down that bastard dragon. I still have never killed him yet, even just for playing for fun. Like I still survival mode, but like you know, not recording for the channel, of course. And uh, I, it, I was like level thirty something or forty something when I went to go fight him once, and the where we spawned in uh, the end, I we were like off of like way off in the distance and we had to build our own bridge over there by like kind of doing that like shift trick where you like right here if i didn't want to fall off you have to hold shift and then you just don't fall off the edge and then you can take like one piece of dirt and go out and do like like that sort of thing and 
I got one block away from getting to the where he was, and he hit me with a fireball, sent me flying, and I fell to my death, and I lost all of my diamond enchanted armor. I, lo- I was so mad. I lost everything. And I put the game down for a solid, I don't know, three, four months because I was just so mad. And here we are. I'm back at it. And the last, last episode, it, oh, my God, that creepy gray ass. Yeah, everything's going gray on me. I, it's time to go inside and make myself a house. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay, looks like we're making a wall house. That's not what I wanted, but uh, that's what it's, that's what it's got to be for now. Damn it. Because um, I... Oh, God, we're already at stone. That's not good. Um, because I... Oh, what the heck? What just happened? Oh, my God. The NVIDIA OpenGL drive to continue. Application must close. No. Java platform binary stop working. Cancel. Stop it. Oh, that's not okay. Damn it. Oh, my God, guys. This... <laughs> this was... This is going to be a great series. <laughs> so maybe... I think the key to doing this now is record from my laptop because it's more than beastly enough to handle recording it and then just play on the tower. So... I guess that's an abrupt stop to this episode. Um, I will uh, I will continue my thoughts about everything I was trying to say earlier, basic, uh, about what Ken and I are going to be doing. Uh, I didn't even get to say that because I was getting ready to dig a hole in the wall. And uh, games that are to come and things of that nature. So uh, you could see this is, this is my title right here. Because I'm fucking... I don't want to talk about it. Okay, guys. uh, (laughs) Thank you for uh, sticking around for this long and my pain in the ass with trying to get all this shit to work. I will catch you next time. If you guys want to see something awesome or just want to see me do something specifically awesome in the series, uh, let me know. I'm pretty well acquainted back with the controls again now. And uh, I'm ready to get back into the swing of things and kick that ender dragon's ass so uh i will see you next time and oh also um if you guys haven't seen this awesome background was made by the coolest channel ever uh karibukai play they are a uh a let's play of sorts just like us i mean we we do let's plays we do you know everything i don't i just just, i don't really want to limit the the possibilities of this channel but um we like to play video games of course and in my finale of super metroid with ken i had talked about uh wanting saying that before samus goes into torian right here in like right before the end of the game it's uh i said it would be awesome if you removed the hud and uh had you know put up uh it could just have samus standing there like that on the elevator and then uh just have this as a computer background and karibukai i think it was officer dan ironically enough i believe he's the one that made it for me i'm sorry if it's not him sir uh I, I just I can't remember if it was him if you were not. But anyway, yeah, uh, it was uh, really nice of them to do that, and it was really flattering and humbling that uh, someone from the community already took the time to do something so awesome for us. And I hope that one day we can return the favor if I ever uh, catch something so awesome for someone else. So uh, be sure to go check out Karibukai Play, uh, Pixels and Pino, Cocktails and Con Souls. They are all awesome people, and uh, I, I I get that they're very mellow and very level-headed and really down-to-earth guys and, and gals. So I will uh, stop rambling now and uh, catch you guys on the flip side. Peace out.